a relaxing day at the links turned frantic. When what looked like a tornado tore through the golf club near UBC. It definitely felt like a movie. Lillian Lee's father, Shea Song, was at the driving range and filmed this video. Hail pelted down, branches and debris whipped through at dangerous speeds while he watched the potentially lethal funnel cloud spiral towards him. Yeah, like branches were like flying everywhere and I guess they're just scared of getting hit. Many ducked for cover, fearing for their lives. There's already some like logs like this big like flying around, so I was pretty terrified, right? I, I would like everybody was pretty shocked. It only lasted a couple of minutes. But the chaos and cleanup that followed the next day seemed endless. The strong winds completely uprooting some large trees. They fell on signs, they fell on cars, they even fell on power lines. And people say with trees as large as this getting knocked down, it's an absolute miracle that no one was hurt. I would never think that I'm able to see something like this in Vancouver. Some trees taller than 20 meters flattened like twigs. One of them falling on top of this car. Luckily, no one was inside. Downed power lines and blocked roadways, most of it along University Boulevard. We've had to reroute some of our buses to and from UBC. So University Boulevard here is close to traffic because of the fallen trees. Never saw them before. Environment Canada says a tornado touched down over the ocean near the airport around 5 p.m. Saturday, startling travelers. But there are still questions on whether a tornado touched down on land. We need to see that the, the funnel of the tornado was touching the ground and that there is some uh, rotational damage on the ground. Meteorologists will continue their investigation to determine whether this can actually be labeled as a tornado, a rare occurrence for the lower mainland. Over the water, water spout tornadoes are somewhat common. We see them every year over the open water. However, for there to be a tornado that makes it onto land on the west coast of BC here is quite rare. But one that thankfully left no one hurt. And that it, it didn't hurt anyone. To him, it's he, he's really thankful. Yeah. University Boulevard is set to open by noon Monday, but with similar strong winds set to hit the southern coast on the same day, there's concern more chaos will follow soon after. Kamal Karmali, Global News.